Hello everyone and welcome to another SQL Server tutorial. In this session, we are going to learn how to add a new column to an existing table. So here I have a TBL employee table. If I expand it and if I expand the columns folder, we can see that we have four columns here. Now let's say if I want to add a new column, I will create a gender column to maintain the genders of all the employees. So let's see how to add a new column to an existing table. So to do that we will write a query. Alter table followed by the name of the table where we are going to add the new column. So it's TBL employee. Then we use the keyword add. Then we will provide the name of the column. So let's say gender and also we need to specify the data type of that particular column. So in this case it will be nware care and we'll specify the length as 10 characters. Now if I go ahead and execute this command completed successfully. So now if I refresh the TBL employee table one more column should appear within the columns folder. So right click and refresh. Now if I expand the columns, I can see that gender column here. So we have successfully created a new column in an existing table. And if I right click on the table and if I select top thousand rows. So here also we can view that newly created gender column. So this is how you create a new column in an existing table. So thanks for watching this video. If you like the video, please hit the like button and subscribe. Thank you.